All right, guys, welcome back to another Elden Ring. Uh, Dark Souls, I mean. Uh, repair whatever you guys repair. She didn't really do much damage compared to me destroying her. Um, as you can see, we maxed out on three. We, uh, not really maxed out. We kind of just upgraded these. Now, we can do two things. One, put on this ring. Oops. No. Um, this one. Now we have an opening door. We'll come back here in a couple of minutes. Um, halt! This is tarnished. It shall not be by the feet of men. If thou okay. art a true disciple of the dark sun, cast aside. Look at her baby face. <laughs> hear the voice of myself, Gwendolyn, and kneel before me. Go ahead and kneel. O oh, disciple of the dark sun. Thou hast journeyed far. Hear my voice. If thou shalt swear by the covenant to become a shadow of Father Gwyn and Sister Guinevere, a blade that shall hunt the foes of our lords, then I shall protect thee, safeguarding thy person with the power of the dark. Mm -hmm. Say yes. We're going to deal with him in a few minutes. Um. Whatever. Uh, no. Do not offer anything because we're going to kill him in a minute. Um, but go back to what's his face. And we're going to give him the material that we found in that uh, undead perch, peach, fridge, whatever we call it. Go back to undead. How easy as that. I ain't gonna mention anything else. Um, we're gonna go downward. Go over here. Talk to the guy. Yada yada yada. How about my foot? Give them to him. Yada yada yada. Now I'm saying, go ahead and reinforce it. We don't have the material, do we? Reinforce. Force it. No, we can't. Not yet. I guess it's a different material that we need to be able to upgrade it even more. Um, because our sword at the moment can go up to 15. Right now we have it at 10. Right? Am I correct? Yeah, we have it at 10. We can max it out to 15. Um. Walk back to this one. And we're gonna fight the guy that's behind the, the wall, I guess you can say. Note the fact that he has three abilities. Oh, okay, kill this chick as well. Kill her. We're gonna be needing her flask, so just go ahead and kill her. Very well. So be it. Expunging food like you is She's a lot easier just because she's cornered against the wall. Anyway, she would have already been pissed if you already did. If you harm Gwydalyn already, she would have attacked you. Um, yeah. But we're gonna need her flask later. Do not use it because you can't really gain materials out of it. You only gain like humanity. And it's very bad if you use it for humanity because then you get no uh, plus flask. So yeah. here go down oh you remember that thing i was telling you about that we should worry about yeah now we have to go down here Over here straight up wait i'm gonna test it out don't test out whatever i'm gonna do go up go ahead go all around and go down and activate the lever Kind of a gun. Do I have bone marrow? Yep. 
I wonder if I saved at his spot. Yes, I did. Oh, well. Does it really matter? Here we go. Remember, it's just trial and error, guys. So, don't hurt yourself. I should have. I had enough time to actually go back and actually upgrade the flask. Oh well. We'll do it next time. Waiting for this thing to go down. It's up here now. Yay. Look at the happy face she has. If you can do it the first time around, good job. If you guys have to do this constantly with this guy it will be really annoying but it's okay it's just trial and error uh, but yeah don't do it exactly what i'm about to do because i'm gonna just test out if i can fall down and actually land on it because look at the far distance of it i think i can fall down and survive uh, in case i don't take this off take this off Take off, take off. Uh, okay. Whee! Nope. <clears throat> nope. <laughs> of course. The game would not make it easy for you. Oh, of course. Oh, look at her scuddy spine. You know what? I'm already here. Uh, warp to Firelink. Oh yeah, this guy is already dead. If you guys are following my, uh, the way I'm doing it, we'll just warp back to Fire Links, offer the soul. Good. So now we have three flasks. Uh, another thing you should do before we actually go ahead, back and kill the wizard, because we are going to go kill the wizard. Go down here. Go all the way down, and we're going to meet our friend. He got annoyed by the bells, so he, or no, not annoyed by the bells, he got annoyed by the smell uh, of rotting death. So he tried to s basically take down the knights. All the wrinkles in her body. This looks nice. Imagine looking at your grandma, she's running around like this. <laughs> Uh, I just gave everybody PTSD. Anyways, go this way. Go down. Go this way. Go ahead and go this way. And go directly this way. Now, our friend will go ahead and attack us because we came hollow. He was trying to, like, stop the smell. So, yeah. And I feel bad for him for trying to attempt to go ahead and do it himself. What an idiot. But you know, he's our idiot. Don't worry, guys. Go ahead and go back up. And we're gonna go ahead and go to. What's their face? Cross the bridge. And I missed. Oh, wait, there's another faster way I can actually do it. Uh, go to. Um, Prince's section. Like pressing such yes, the princess. Go go to the princess um, coliseum, whatever. There's a faster way to get to that uh, fire link without having to go through the nuns, because I believe the nuns are a lot harder than the other stuff. I think the other stuff are just very easy to deal with. Um, so warp to yeah, this one, princess. Warp to the princess. Now, she can talk to us. She won't really be mad at us at all for what we've done, so it's okay. This thing's taking for her to get back up, isn't it? Yep. Now, I'm saying this way is a lot easier. I mean, it's way easy. Like, 
like I don't have to deal with so much blue. These guys you can run around. I would say take the right. Because there is, remember, the knight that's in that way. Who would be are the archery. Go around this way. Go this way. I know I opened up the gate. Straight forward. It's... I would still say this is a lot easier. Because the knights will still follow you. That's the thing. Uh, either way you can go. You can go down that way or go down this way. Either way they both lead you the same direction that you need to go to. Go this way. Take it right. Go this way. Over here. He'll be welding. Ignore everybody else. Run across. <clears throat> Ow. Ignore this guy as well. And go downward and activate the lever. See how easy that was? Going towards the princess to this area is a lot easier than going that way to over here. Like, did you see how quick that was? Uh, let's go for something nice. Ooh, this one looks nice here. Um, look at the little princes. Anyways, go this way. That looks like it's it's on her skirt, like she's stepping on the skirt. This is very weird. Compared to the Elden Ring skirt that I that I had, and I always played through, or had her playing through, this is very weird. Anyways, uh, I think that goes up. We're going down. Unless this thing goes up, yeah. Now her sleeves are down. That's how I like it. Rest here, repair whatever you need to repair. Uh, reverse your Halloween if you want to. Uh, I would say it's better off not to or do so. It's however you feel like it or feel comfortable with. I prefer her human form. Now going through here, it's it's either you go without a shield or heavy equipment or go in with heavy equipment. The reason why I'm saying this is because this guy is very, I guess, annoying. Someone. What foolishness. Mm-hmm. Why would a blade of the dark moon trespasseth upon the great lord's tomb? Right. the words of myself, Gwyndolin. Thou shalt not go up. He's going to do a bunch of different type of moves. They're f very easy if you know how to avoid all of them. So when he's doing those big ones, you can tell when he's doing his little whip. Avoid just going zigzag. Sometimes you'll probably have to barrel roll. He will be doing those type of stuff. He's going zigzag. Oh, suck a gun. Yeah, just be very careful with it. Like I said, born arrows. If you get behind a pillar, he will get mad about it and shoot you one of those. Uh oh. Four arrows, four arrows, four arrow. 
And then he's gonna probably hit me with magic. Damn it. Didn't get enough time. Those things are annoying. Born arrow again, surprisingly. One more. Yes. So he's already halfway health. This is where he starts getting mad. So. And I don't mean mad, he just gets frustrated with me. Like I do with him. Son of a gun, I hate when he teleports out. It's like a little... <sighs> little wuss. Now he will do a double thing. Damn it. Son of a gun. See? And he's gonna do that. Those things can go through walls, so careful with them. Why didn't it slash? I'm not even using my shield to be honest. Hide behind this pillar. And you guys can actually just see. See how he gets frustrated when I hide behind the pillar? So he's basically saying, get out of here. Side to side. Side to side. Side to side. Damn it, one more hit would have done it. Now here, I gotta be really careful because he's close to death. And I'm close to not having hardly anything. He's gonna run out of these. He gets frustrated. Shoots me those. Shoots me again. Shoots me with those. Ooh, ooh. One more and I would have been dead. Born arrows. There we go. Now he's dead. Oh, heretic. Swathed in dark. An eternal curse upon thee. Yep. Now, luckily, I did this with my first round, and not the second round, because he does get a lot more annoying when he does it again. Uh, it usually just takes you at least one. It takes you one time to do it, but it takes you at least five minutes to do it in, depending how you're doing it. I did it fairly quickly because I remember all his strategies and everything. <clears throat> And I went light mode. I went on light uh, equipment. It's best to go on light equipment and then heavy equipment. That's for magic users. If you guys are any magic users, uh, there's this outfit, the armor. Yeah. <clears throat> Anyways, we already defeated him. Like I said, he was one of the main bosses, side bosses, I guess you can say. There is at least like, I don't know, 20 side bosses and then there's like 26 main bosses. So yeah. <clears throat> and that's because I think there's only like, what, 10 more to go? So yeah. Later on, we're gonna need to deal with the Four Kings. That is the next destination we're gonna head to. And it's gonna be very, how can I put it, uh, chaotic. Um, do I have his little soul? Does he? Yep, he gives me a soul. He is Gwendolyn. The lady that we saw is his sister, Gwendolyn, but she died a long time ago, so she's basically just a uh, facade, I guess you can say. She's not real, she's not actually there. Uh, so that's what I'm saying. If we were to actually hit her, she would actually disappear. And the self-conscious person is the guy that we're fighting with. Hence that he was saying something about being a who knows what a couple of minutes ago. Uh, head back to Firelink.
we can do this within one game playthrough. I'm hoping I can. Do upgrade your uh, flask. I believe you can upgrade it. First, let me do it, and then you guys can follow. I'm seeing if we can do this. Kindle? Yes, we can. This will give you at least 15. Right? Yeah. Even better. I'm gonna head off there, guys, but we are gonna be heading down to whatever you call it. I'm out of there. Yeah, I like what you guys are saying. Like, comment, share, do all the cool things. And note the fact that you will have a little trouble in the next game video. But it's gonna be okay because I'm gonna have a little trouble with it. Um, learn how to parry. That's all you need to learn. But that's 